so today is the 15th of April and uh, we've just come out for our daily exercise and today we've explored further up the road where we uh, have walked before we usually turn uh, into there and go around the circuit but today we're going to take this footpath which we've just spotted we knew there must be one here somewhere there we are public footpath and this we think joins up with where we were yesterday at Bagenden I think this goes down across the field and comes out at the bottom of Bagenden so we're going to take this little route. Uh, Carol, can you hold the, the video while I put my COVID-19 gloves on? Straight ahead down this down this hill I think we will go down into the valley uh, where yesterday's video or maybe earlier today's video depends on when we uh, when we post them um, but it goes down into the valley where we saw all the sheep and uh, and walked along and back round through the village yesterday so today we we decided we'd try and find this this now I've just spotted over here in the wood bluebells. Bluebells, look at that. Try and get those in shot. Little woodland area absolutely full of bluebells. I think it's a little bit early really, 14th, 15th of April today. Is it 14th? Yeah, yesterday was the 13th. Okay, 14th, 14th of April. That's what I said just now, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah, yeah okay. Um, so, uh, yeah, we're in week three of lockdown. We were counting the days, now we're counting the weeks. Uh, speculation has it that there'll be at least another three weeks announced uh, towards the end of this week. The government review is on Thursday and uh, everybody's expecting it to be extended uh, because there's no sign of a drop in the figures. The rise might be lessening, but that's about the best you can say at the minute. But look at the view. Mm. Look at that view. Built those houses there. Yeah, those are the houses again. An earlier video and some pictures show those modern houses there, and uh, they're very eco friendly houses. I personally don't like the look of them, but I applaud the, the sentiment. Um, but they've got such an amazing view down this valley. I don't know whether it's called the Churn Valley because um, certainly the benefit is the Churn, Churn Valley benefit, isn't yeah. it? So whether this is the part of the Churn Valley, uh, I'm not entirely sure. But we're going to get an even better view down the valley as we come over the crest of this little bit of hill. Yeah, look at that. That field over there, Carol, is where I think is the field that we walked by that had the llama in it, or the llamas in it before. Actually, there's sheep in this field, look, just ahead of us. There's a, a ewe with a couple of lambs. So we'll walk quietly so as not to disturb, but uh, she appears to have the whole field to herself. <laughs> now I wonder if she's supposed to be in here or whether somebody left the gate open. 
and she's escaped into here. Oh, there's another one there, in the shade, yeah. under the trees. So, and she's got a lamb with her as well. So we'll walk softly. No, not to disturb them. Hello. Look at you. Your little lamb. Keeping in the shade, keeping cool. It's not that hot today. So she's only got one. Oh, there's some more down the bottom there, look. Oh. Yeah, so there's clearly quite a few of them in here. That ewe has only just given birth. Oh, yeah. She's still licking them. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. So we just missed the birth. Yeah. Yeah. Just having it their like first, their first drink feed and feed. Yeah, she's still got some of the, um, what do you call it, dripping out, mm, well, fluid. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> placenta. Placenta, yeah. Mm. So she's just given birth. Yeah. She's given them a good licking by the look of it. But they've still got a little bit of staining on them. Is she having another one? Oh no, it's just me looking at the head. Yeah. She's fly back to us. Yeah. I don't think she's having any here. No. <laughs> well, she doesn't seem to be in any distress. No. So, that's been a successful, yeah. successful birth by the look of it. The little ones are sort of nosing around for a drink. How amazing. We probably only missed them by a very short while, yeah, I would yeah, think. An hour, maybe. Yeah. So we'll carry on walking softly by. Ah, I see where we are, Carol. We're further back than we thought. Yeah? Because that's actually not where the llamas were. That is the um, where the where the horses are. So we're coming down to the lane that leads to Bagenden rather than coming down to Bagenden itself. On this particular path. So that'd make a nice little round walk, wouldn't it? Back along. So there we are coming down to the valley. Uh, previous walks we've walked along the bottom of this, this valley. And Bagenden is over that way. And we've walked from that direction. So we're coming down for, um, a shorter, shorter way than we thought we were. But that's fine. We keep exploring, keep finding new paths. It'll be interesting to see where this exactly comes out because I didn't actually, I haven't seen a, a path coming up here no. from uh, from down below. So we must have missed it. Oh, and she knows. So there's a gate here. So I guess we are supposed to walk down that path down there rather than on the field side. Right, gloves back out. The balls are up there. I think. Mm. See if we can get a picture. There he is. Looking a bit like a buzzard to me. Mm. Might not be. Carol's got a picture of him. Maybe somebody can tell us why. For sure. <laughs> Look at that little sheep. Oh, there we go. That's the gate put back. 
And more sheep. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So we'll follow this path down, see where it goes. Okay, well, we've got about 10 minutes of videoing. You've got the picture. I'll take a couple of photographs at the bottom to show where it comes out. There's the valley going back down. That's the way we will walk back along and round the other side back to the campsite. <laughs> yeah. They're also scratching up against the against the posts that's lined with wool. <laughs> All right, well, God bless everybody. Um, hope you've enjoyed this little walk out in the Gloucestershire countryside. If you have, give us a thumbs up. Sorry about the wobble, I keep having an she knows. Um, if you haven't subscribed, then please do subscribe. And uh, as I say, give us a thumbs up. Make a comment on, face, uh, on Facebook or on um, YouTube but we'd really love for you to sign up to our YouTube channel because uh, it's nice to see that we've got quite a lot of subscribers we get far more view viewers than we have subscribers which is quite interesting so with that uh, and pictures of the glorious glorious countryside on this sunny but a little bit chilly day We'll say goodbye. Say goodbye, Carol. Goodbye, Carol. <laughs> goodbye, Carol. No, she's still not getting it. Okay. <laughs> Bye for now. <laughs>